Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. My dear brothers and sisters, let us seek for the intercession of our dear Mother. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to their protection implored the help, or sought the intercession, or left the needed. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto you, O Virgin of Virgins, my Mother. To you do we come, before you stand, sinful and sorrowful, O Mother of the Word incarnate. Despise not our petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer us. Amen. Dear friends, let us gaze at our God who is present in the Blessed Sacrament, who has made us to be proud of His presence, our healer, our guide, our counselor, our redeemer and saviour. He does not let us fall. Even if we fall, He lifts us up. Let us be thankful for this wonderful God. Let us at this moment thank Him for the gift of life. Let us thank Him for one another. Let us, let us thank Him for our family. Let us thank Him for all the people in our workplace. Let us thank Him for our children for our parents, grandparents, for our friends and relatives, for our teachers, our doctors, nurses, our lawyers, advocates, our priests, nuns, governments, politicians, and everyone. Today we are going to pray in a very special way for those who feel that they have failure in life. We ask our dear Lord to bless all of us. We ask our Lord to grant us blessings that we may not remain in the fallen situations but rise up. Let us sing the hymn A thirty on page sixteen from the Joyful Lips. Let me sing of your law, my God. Let your love come upon your people. Let me sing of your law, my God. Let your love come upon your people. Through your own world, Lord, give us life. In your holy keeping, happy is my soul. Let me sing of your love, my God. Let your love come upon your people. Let me sing of your love, my God. 
Let your love come upon your people. I have made known to you my will. You have heard my pleading. Now teach me, O Lord. Let me sing of your law, o my God. Let your love come upon your people. For our morning prayer, let us take Psalm 95. Proclaim to the nations, God is King. Alleluia. O sing a new song to the Lord. Sing to the Lord all the earth. O oh, sing to the Lord, bless his name. Proclaim his help day by day. Tell among the nations his glory and his wonders among all the peoples. The Lord is great and worthy of praise, to be feared above all gods. The gods of the heathens are not. It was the Lord who made the heavens. His are majesty and state and power and splendor in his holy place. Give the Lord, you families of peoples, give the Lord glory and power, give the Lord the glory of his name. Bring an offering and enter his courts. Worship the Lord in his temple. O earth, tremble before him. Proclaim to the nations, God is king. The world he made firm in its place. He will judge the peoples in fairness. Let the heavens rejoice and earth be glad. Let the sea and all within it thunder praise. Let the land and all it bears rejoice. All the trees of the wood shout for joy. At the presence of the Lord, for he comes. He comes to rule the earth. With justice he will rule the world. He will judge the peoples with his truth. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Proclaim to the nations, God is King. Alleluia. For our scripture reading, let us take from Romans chapter 10, verses 10, 8 to 10. The word is near you, on your lips and in your heart. That is the word of faith which we preach. Because if you confess with your lips that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. For man believes with his heart and so is justified and he confesses with his lips, and so is saved. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. My dear brothers and sisters, let us raise our hands in thanksgiving and our voices in praises to God, praying for those who experience failures so that the Lord's mercy press upon them and they rise up from their failures to new life. Merciful God, I take authority over any feelings of failure and self-hatred, negativity, self-pity, anger in Jesus' name. Let family patterns of failure now cease, touch deeper levels of failure. God help them Cancel any negative vows made through the failure. Take down walls and defenses and all hindrances to your healing power. Speak deeply to their hearts and help them move forward with humility and compassion. Fill them with your spirit, Lord, and turn the failures around for good. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. 
Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Worship you, Jesus. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Spirit of God. Thank you, Mama Mary. Thank you, all the angels and saints. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God and Father, to those who go astray, you reveal the light of your truth and enable them to return to the right path. Grant that all who have received the grace of baptism may strive to be worthy of their Christian calling and reject everything opposed to it, especially those who experience failure and those who fail to give up. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. My dear brothers and sisters, let us at this moment thank the Lord and feel his graciousness as we sing the hymn of the benediction and receive his blessings. Let us bow in adoration to this Blessed be God, blessed be His holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be His most sacred heart, blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit of Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be St. Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Amen.